Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you a summer haul. I'm going to show you all the items and I'm also going to try them on for you to show you how they fit. Including clothing, swimwear, shoes, accessories, everything that you can think of. Summer is quickly coming to an end, which I feel like summer didn't even happen. I don't know where it went. There's a ton of different brands that I'm going to be mentioning. I will post the links or other information about them, uh, each item and brand, in the description box or on the screen here in like a annotation. The first item is this romper here. This is from lightinthebox.com. I was a little iffy at first to try that site out. The website is super, super cheap. I do like to online shop a lot to find good deals, bargains, uh, discounts, just to save money while I'm buying things that are trendy or may not be something I might wear next year. This one's definitely good for the summer. You can wear it as an outfit itself, like a romper, or you can wear it as a cover-up to the beach or the pool. When you're sipping champagne in Vegas, maybe you own a yacht, or maybe you just want to wear it around the house. I don't know. <laughs> but I love this romper, and so does my boyfriend too, actually. He really liked it. I don't know. He's so stylish. <laughs> It has this really beautiful print. They had multiple prints, but I just loved this one the most. And it also has like this white lace detailing all around it. All those colors in the background are distracting. So let's just move on over. I'll come back for you. It has the shorts here with the higher slit on each side and sort of like a quarter length sleeve. That's also kind of like a bat wing, I guess. Like a bell bottom for your armpit. Very lightweight, very soft, super comfortable. You can wear a swimsuit under it or you can wear a bra or nothing, whatever floats your boat. I always like to tell you guys the sizes because some brands or lines I feel run very different. I got this in a medium and I'm glad I did. The only reason I actually did that was because I read the product review, which I always do when I order something online, and everyone else said the same thing. So they all said order a size up, and I ordered a medium, mainly because of the tatas. So I had to make sure that there were room for the girls to hang out. Well, not hang out, hang in, I should say. Next is this dress, or drape dress, from Charlotte Russe. This is a size small, and it's this beautiful, like, teal color. Like spaghetti strap, halter-ish. It's not really a halter, but I don't even know how to describe this. But this is the front, which you can see it on, also. Uh, sort of a v-neck here, then a layer of fabric over top of the actual dress itself. And then it has this back that drapes down. So it's sort of a sexy potato sack, which actually looks super flattering on. I think it's great for multiple types of occasions. Uh, you could pull it off for day or night. I actually bought it for a wedding that I was going to attend, but due to scheduling I couldn't make the wedding. I don't know, I could just wear it out, dinner, drinks, just because I feel like getting dressed up, whatever. Yay for Charlotte Russe. My newest clothing store or brand that I've been obsessed with is Agassi. I actually had never heard of it before until a few months ago when our mall decided to be awesome and put one in. This is a kimono that I got from there. It is like a floral print, but it's a darker, sheer print. I purchased this in a size small, and it can be worn in a couple different ways. It has like this bat wing style, and it's longer in the back. And then these two parts in the front that kind of just hang out. You can either leave it open and draped over you, or you can wear it tied up. And create more of a form-fitted or even, I would say, dressier appearance to it. More of a top appearance rather than just draping over. I'm obsessed with it, I think it's beautiful, and I had so many people compliment asking where it came from and where they could get it. Every time I go in there I want to buy everything. I walked by there yesterday and they just redid the entire store. They moved everything around and stocked with a bunch of new items and it took everything in me to not go in there. I just peeked in like as far as my neck could go, but I'm trying to save up my money for Gen Beauty and Beautycon which are coming up very soon. I'm very excited. Eee! By the way, give a thumbs up and comment below if you are attending either or both of those events. I would love to see you guys there. I picked this up from Marshalls. It's a, like a sundress, 
It's a coral color spaghetti strap, has like this little band detail here. Uh, it goes right above my knee, and it has this open back here, which I do like. This part is elastic, so it's easy for fitting, and it's also comfortable, very casual. You could, of course, dress it up with accessories or your jewelry, but I thought it was a perfect day-to-night dress. The back makes it a little fancier, a little sexier. This one hair is, like, bothering me. Actually, all my hairs are bothering me. <laughs> what brand is this? This is, or was, oh, well, originally it was American Eagle, and it's a size small. Yay for savings! I also love American Eagle in general. I still shop there. But when I can find a brand that I already love at a discounted store, it's just pure joy. It's like the heavens open up. <laughs> I have another romper from Light in the Box. It is a floral print, but more neutral tone. It has tiny little short sleeves. I wouldn't even call them short sleeves. I would say more of like a cap. And they are short with a ruffle sort of detail on the bottom. Same print on the back, elastic around the waist. And it has two pieces that drape down in the front as well. You could wear this piece open, or you can tie the little tie guys a few different ways, depending on how modest you want the top of it to be. Uh, this one is a size small, but super, super cheap and high quality. The fabric is very soft. I like that it was neutral with a tiny pop of color, nothing too intense. This next guy is super slinky. It is this crochet, I don't even know what's called, uh, a cover up? Hardly there thing that I saw and figured would be perfect for vacation or on the beach or to and from the pool whenever I have this imaginary vacation. <laughs> I don't know, just something about it was very striking to me. It was very different. I hadn't seen anything like it before. It's very open back, uh, open sides. I got this guy from the lookbook store, and it is a size small. So check them out. I actually love that store. I've only ordered from them a few times, but every time that I did, I was never disappointed. They have a lot of trending items or popular styles, and they're super affordable. Here is another top from Agassi. It is a brighter floral print and it has this strap detail, sort of like a Y back with a zipper here. And the zipper goes all the way down, so it does open all the way up. Which is actually perfect because if you're not going to wear a bra with it, which I didn't slash don't, uh, the fit is tight enough, or at least I bought it to be tight enough, to where you don't need one. It holds the girls in place. You can see here it kind of goes up in the front area or the chest. Which is good, you're not going to get too much cleavage. And I bought this little guy in a size small. The last clothing item I purchased is the Agassi shorts that look like this. Which are so cool! Look at that pattern. It's very bright and fun. And they are high-waisted, which I also love because I like wearing crop tops with them. And I just think it's like super sassy. I feel like people are in a love-hate relationship with rompers, play suits, um, and high-waisted shorts. Some people call them diapers. I call them super trendy and very comfortable. Potato, potato. It is a zipper back that goes down like a quarter of the way. I purchased these in a size small. One time I wore it with a white tank top that was tight from Express, like a fitted one, and then another time I wore it with a crop top. You can wear this in a ton of different ways or with a ton of different items. I think they are more on the dressier side, but whatever, if you want to rock them out during the day while you're grocery shopping, be my guest. If you guys have any other questions about this video or anything at all, make sure you read the description box or comment below. I would also love it if you leave any video requests for me in the comment section too. I always read those and I do screenshot or write them down, so believe me, I do have an entire list of all your requests and ideas for upcoming videos. It's just taking me kind of forever to get to all of them, but I do take them all into consideration and I do appreciate every time you guys comment, whether it's a request or a question or whatever it is. And my ring almost just flew off because it's too big for my finger.